Hey there, science fans. Today, we're diving into the world of cation exchange membranes, or CEMs for short. These membranes are like tiny filters with a superpower. They can selectively allow certain types of charged particles, called ions, to pass through while blocking others. Now, you might be wondering, what's so special about that? Well, this selective filtering ability makes CEMs incredibly useful in a wide range of applications, from purifying water to generating clean energy. But before we get ahead of ourselves, let's break down what CEMs are all about. Acacian exchange membrane is a type of ion selective membrane that permits the passage of cations while blocking anions. Its mechanism is based on the selective transport of positively charged ions, or cations, across the membrane. This selective filtering action is the key to their amazing abilities. So, buckle up as we explore the fascinating world of CEMs and discover how they're making our world a cleaner, more sustainable place. All right, let's unravel the mystery of how these cation exchange membranes actually work. Picture this. You have a solution containing a mix of positive and negative ions. When this solution comes into contact with a CEM, something amazing happens. Remember those special pores we talked about? They contain negatively charged groups that act like magnets for cations. As the solution flows through the membrane, the cations are attracted to these negative charges and bind to them. But here's the catch. The membrane doesn't just hold on to these cations forever. Instead, it facilitates a process called ion exchange. In this process, the bound cations are released from the membrane surface and replaced by other cations from the solution. This continuous exchange of cations is what allows the membrane to selectively transport positive charges while keeping negative ions at bay. The relationship between mass transfer and conductivity is pivotal, as the membrane's efficiency is determined by how well it facilitates ion movement, directly influencing its conductivity. So, how do we create these incredible cation exchange membranes? It all starts with polymers, those long chains of molecules that make up many materials we use every day. To create a CEM, we need a special type of polymer that can be modified to have those all-important negative charges. One common type of polymer used is called polystyrene divinyl benzene. This polymer is like a sturdy scaffold, providing the membrane with its structural integrity. To give it its ion exchange properties, we introduce negatively charged groups, often sulfonic acid groups, onto the polymer chains. These negatively charged groups act as the cation magnets, attracting and binding positive ions. Once the polymer is modified, it's time to turn it into a thin, flexible membrane. This can be done through various techniques, such as solution casting, where the polymer is dissolved in a solvent, spread onto a surface, and then dried to form a thin film. Another method is called melt extrusion, where the polymer is heated until it becomes molten, and then forced through a narrow die to create a continuous sheet. The final step involves treating the membrane to further enhance its properties, such as increasing its porosity or improving its chemical resistance. And voila, we have ourselves a cation exchange membrane ready to tackle some serious filtration challenges. Now that we know how cation exchange membranes are made, let's talk about what makes them so powerful. Key performance indicators include ion conductivity, which measures the membrane's efficiency in transporting ions. Higher conductivity means faster and more efficient ion transport, which is essential for many applications. 
Another critical aspect is chemical stability. CEMs often operate in harsh environments, exposed to strong acids, bases, or oxidizing agents. They need to be tough enough to withstand these conditions without degrading or losing their filtering abilities. Mechanical strength is also vital, especially for applications involving high pressures or mechanical stress. Nobody wants a membrane that tears or breaks down easily. Finally, selectivity is key. CEMs need to be picky eaters, allowing only the desired cations to pass through while blocking unwanted ions. This selectivity is crucial for applications like water purification, where we want to remove specific contaminants without affecting the essential minerals. So, there you have it. Conductivity, stability, strength, and selectivity. The four pillars of cation exchange membrane power. All right, science buffs. Let's dive into the exciting world of cation exchange membrane applications. Cation exchange membranes have diverse applications across multiple industries. One of their most important uses is in water treatment. CEMs play a crucial role in desalination, the process of removing salt from seawater to produce fresh water. By selectively removing sodium ions, CEMs help turn salty ocean water into a valuable resource for drinking, irrigation and industrial processes. But that's not all. These versatile membranes are also used in electrodialysis, a process that uses an electric current to separate ions and purify water. CEMs act as gatekeepers, allowing only specific ions to pass through, effectively removing contaminants and producing high purity water. Beyond water treatment, cation exchange membranes are making waves in the energy sector, particularly in fuel cells and redox flow batteries. In fuel cells, CEMs help facilitate the electrochemical reactions that generate electricity from hydrogen fuel. Their selective ion transport ensures a continuous flow of protons, enabling the fuel cell to operate efficiently. Similarly, in redox flow batteries, CEMs play a vital role in separating the electrolyte solutions, preventing mixing, while allowing ion exchange for charge storage and discharge. As we strive for cleaner energy solutions, cation exchange membranes are emerging as key players in the quest for a sustainable future. Hold on to your lab coats, science fans, because the future of cation exchange membranes is brighter than ever. Researchers around the world are constantly working to develop new and improved membranes with enhanced properties and expanded applications. One exciting area of research is the development of new membrane materials with higher conductivity, improved stability and enhanced selectivity. Scientists are exploring novel polymers, inorganic materials and hybrid composites to push the boundaries of membrane performance. Another promising avenue is the development of thinner, more efficient membranes that require less energy to operate. This is particularly important for applications like desalination and energy storage, where energy efficiency is paramount. Furthermore, researchers are exploring ways to incorporate cation exchange membranes into new and innovative technologies, such as sensors, actuators, and biomedical devices. From purifying water to generating clean energy and beyond, cation exchange membranes are poised to play an even greater role in shaping a sustainable future. So, stay curious, keep exploring, and who knows what amazing discoveries await us in the world of science.